time on a 143. Hello and welcome to another video from UKCD and in today's video we're going to be looking at go-karts the speedy oh, tiny in, little in. fucking bastards yes these little fucking things are unbelievably fast I'm, I'm not kidding how fast these little shat dogs are honestly yeah the amount of steering on my wheel during this race was, I think I managed to turn it about an inch each way. They really are that sharp on the steering. And for the first couple of laps, we struggled and we were laughing. It's just such a brilliant experience in the go-karts. But when you actually get used to it, you can absolutely fly around these corners. As you can see at the bottom right, I've got four blue tyres. My tyres are cold, so I'm having to take it a little bit easy on this first lap. But my god, these are so much fun. You get that into the racing with the other cars, which feels very simish, uh, very difficult technical. And these just feel like an absolute blast from the grind of the simulation and uh, absolutely brilliant fun. But it's not to say that they aren't uh, difficult to drive. As you can see, I actually clipped Clip the bank in there or the chevrons and with a too much accelerator these are 250 cc the i think um quite easily able to spin so you can see my front tires warming up now absolutely blasting First. out here so if you haven't had a go in the go-karts or you're uh, thinking of getting project cars there's something in this game for everybody so here we are at Le Mans 24 hours or in our case two and a half minutes Yes, we're on go-karts. This is a multiplayer online with the uh, UK CD guys and as you can see from the start I thought it would be better that I should just hold back a little bit and let these guys mix it up. Look at this, look, bloody flies buzzing around all over the place. Now, as we come down here this first section I actually got a lucky break there straight through the couple of these drivers and there seems to be a lot of smoke on here that I don't actually remember being in the uh, actual race at the time, so whether that's a bug, I'm not sure. Now the great fun with these is that you've got no mirrors, so it's completely difficult to want to overtake somebody. It really is either communication between you, I'm on your left, I'm on your right, blah blah blah, and overtaking. And the only issue we've found at the minute is that in-game, as we blast down here at full blast, is that when the names are both in game, the names are too small. It can be quite difficult to tell who's who. So they come screaming down here. The next main part of this is going to be the braking zone. Of course, with each different vehicle, your braking zone is going to be different. And we play with a fixed interior cam, either the actual steering wheel or the helmet cam. Those are the only views we allow. And we also play with full sim, no assists on, and full manual gears which does take quite a while as I mentioned earlier the amount of turning circle on here is minute with these go-karts but absolutely a fantastic and great fun to drive these especially if you can get in a server with 32 of you absolutely brilliant so as we come down here straight into this left hander nice smooth little turn as you can see there's a bit of bump and grind going on it's inevitable in this in this kind of a race with these cars and we're going to come bombing down here, absolutely flying down here. Managed to pull back a place, and these two guys in front, it looks like they're weaving in and out of each other as the leader pulls away down here. Absolutely bombing it down. So it's lucky for me, a couple of riders, uh, actually one bumped up the track at the left, and one came off. Uh, giving me a chance to pull back a little bit, but as you can see, I took that corner rather slow and the guy behind me has come absolutely flying past. It's very easy with these carts to um, make a mistake and at these speeds, and the acceleration and you know, how zippy they are, it's quite easily to catch up. And if you make a mistake, sometimes you can be five, six seconds behind the pace trying to get back on. So that's all part of the excitement with these go-carts. Right-hander coming down into a really sharp left-hand bender here. I think I actually took that a little bit conservative, really. I could have really just uh, kept the accelerator on full blast. Really tight right hand bender here. Um, now, made a mistake there a little bit. Again, could have got my foot down. Kept it, they kept the accelerator on, would have kept me um, in, in line with these guys and trying to catch them up. 
as we come down here we're actually getting into the last section of this race so really I know that unless these guys make a mistake I am gonna really struggle so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push it a little bit we've passed one and that's the big mistake we've made with these tiny little bastard shytalks going off into the gravel is an absolute nightmare and I mean a nightmare it is so slow trying to get off here and it's just heart-wrenching when you can see all the other drivers flying past you as you can see I actually lost four places there just by coming off on that corner and um, pretty much now I know it's a bit of a cruise in because I actually became last at this point but still that's racing brilliant absolutely love these go cats if you want to join the UK CD guys our websites at the bottom we have a team speak which by the looks of it we're gonna to have to expand we're up to nearly 100 members the way things are going um, and obviously you can only get 32 players in a server so we'll be have to set some more servers up it's any age any standard and you can have a pad wheel whatever as long as you've got the racing maturity to want to race clean and enjoy racing or a bit of banter along the way you're more than welcome anyway I'll see you in the next UK CD video Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Oh, I forgot to say. Play it or not? Play whatever the fuck you want to play.